Hi everyone! Finally, today is my first day in law school. I can finally say that I'm officially a law student. I remember doing a get ready with me in my first day in college four years ago and now I have another first week of school vlog and this time it's in law school. But honestly, I do feel excited right now. During summer, people would ask me how I feel about going to law this sem. And I would always say that I'm anxious and excited. But right now, I think I'm more of excited. Sorry, I wasn't able to tell you. Today is August 14, 4 p.m. My classes will start at 5.30 and at 8.30. You guys will come along with me. I will be driving to school today. So guys, some people are asking me what I did during the summer in preparations for law school. And honestly, I couldn't tell you something profound. All I did was enjoy my summer. This summer is more of for myself, for my mental health, for my growth as a person. It's a rainy afternoon but the sun's slowly coming out already. Aside from a lot of self-reflection, I also um, tried to figure out how to manage my time, my finances, also my relationships. Face on the TV. It's been some time since we last Today is my second day of school. Time check, it's 11 a.m. Um, I'm supposed to wake up at 8 a.m. But I decided to extend my sleep because I'm feeling a bit under the weather. My throat hurts. This is actually one of the worst feelings ever. When you're living alone and you get sick, no one gets to take care of you. So right now, I really have to help myself. I cooked myself some soup. I took some meds and went back to sleep because I don't want this to get worse. It's still my second day of school. I'm so tired. I feel so tired. I have to shower and then go to school early so that I can study and actually have a learning environment para my encourage homebody. Hi everyone, it is day two. Time check, it is 2 p.m. I just waited for the rain to stop because I'm not feeling well. Good thing Julia gave me this really cute inhaler. It has little smiley. She gave this to me yesterday. I would have thought it would be very helpful. The next day, a mask. Today I have the same schedule. 5.30 for my first class and everything will end at 8.30. And I'm super excited also because I'm going to be getting my new lamp I got from Facebook Marketplace. Hopefully it's nice. Hopefully we're not damaged. Really looking forward to it. So guys, I grabbed some coffee. I'm here at Family Mart Panila. I know my throat is killing me right now, but I really can't. Like I need coffee today to function. Otherwise, I'm gonna be hopeless later, so please allow me to have iced coffee. I don't drink hot coffee, by the way. I don't really like hot beverages. I also got onigiri from Family Mart. Um, this one's tuna mayo. Mmm. Mmm, God. So guys, I haven't eaten anything except soup this morning. I'm gonna have to validate my ID. That's why I'm gonna go to school early. So I haven't mentioned my outfit for today. My top is basically just this white long sleeves from uh, Uniqlo. And then my pants are the normal Zara mom jeans and my shoes. Right now I'm still wearing my Burks because I'm driving. But I'm gonna wear this pair. 
these are from Golden Goose. This vlog will be mostly consisting of us talking inside my car. Because that's like the only time na I have so much, you know, free time. Now I feel so much better with caffeine in my system. I still have time to get my lamp. So you guys are gonna come along with me. I'm in school right now and luckily I found a parking spot right away which is kind of rare if you're in downtown area. I'm two hours early for my class which is also rare. <laughs> um, no, because I'm trying to see like when's the best time to travel for school because this is my new reality now. At least I'm already guys kung when I'm leave. I don't want to be late in law school. I'm gonna let you guys see my lamp. It's really big. I'm excited for this, so I wanted to show you guys. I can pull it out all the way. Wait, actually I can. This is how it looks like. Um, I'm just gonna wait until later somehow. <sighs> Too bad, I wanted to show you guys the entire thing, but I cannot. See you guys later. Children have followed the footsteps of their father, they're stuck in his evil trail. If only they had heard the word of their kind mother, who says when he gets bad, bail. He has studied greatly, yet has never learned a smidgen of a single thing. They had met when they were younger, but are now far gone, and she morphs into a frail. my new lamp unfortunately I can't give you guys a room tour just yet I'm in the process of renovating my room the interiors of it so what I can show you guys are the furnitures that I'll get along the way um, the final reveal of the room tour Siguro mga 3-4 months from now or even more than that. Slowly but surely because I'm doing the renovations myself and I'm in law school so that will probably cause more delays. But anyway, back to the topic. I got this lab from Facebook Marketplace. I can't believe I got this for for 900 pesos. Supposedly 1,000 but um, I'm behind you guys. By the way guys, I'm still not feeling well, but I got excited <laughs> because of this. This is how it looks like when it's on. Uh, my background feels a bit more homey, finally. Um, I haven't mentioned it to you guys. Planning to strategically arrange my room into parts. Um, I'm gonna have a specific part in my room where I can study, which is here. I'm also planning to add shelves. More shelves at the back, probably. And then, I have an extra room here in the back. This will be my closet. I've read that it's important to separate your working area and your sleeping area. That's how you avoid insomnia. The time check, it's 10.55pm. My bedtime is in an hour. This week is like super hectic week for me. So, yeah. I'll see you guys tomorrow. The ultimate combo that will leave you smelling really good. Who would have thought your adventure turned into a forever? <laughs> Comment down below the best corned beef brand. Minus pure foods. Drinking myself down the drain. You used to live within the clouds, yet still somehow had stayed grounded for more than five years. And I'm terrified for you now, shell of the woman I once knew. I hope I'll find. It's raining like really hard right now. I'm tracked. It's five. 
10 p.m. I'm actually in main area now. I've been circling around the campus looking for parking. I'm late. Hopefully, I make it to class before 5.30. I still have 20 minutes, but you know, you can never expect what will happen. It's 5.20. I have 10 minutes to walk, though it's very near long. So, bye-bye. It's 11.25. It's almost my bedtime. I'm trying to build this habit of going to bed at 12 midnight. I usually go to bed late, mga around 2 a.m. during the summer or even like 3 or 4 a.m. So I'm trying to like build a proper sleeping habit for myself because it's so important, especially right now that I have lots of things to do and lots of things in mind. So rest should be a priority my classes end at 8 30 p.m every day monday to friday i'm actually happy about my schedule now it ends at 8 30 because at least going home di na masyadong traffic when my classes finish at 8 30 siguro mga 40 to an hour drive na lang going back to my house so i will be able to eat my dinner at around um, 9.30 to 10 p.m. So, medyo late na, guys. And it kind of sucks if you're living alone because you then have to prepare your own food. So, soon, we'll transition into that. We'll, we'll try to meal prep in the future. But for now, I'm just slowly um, slowly adjusting and letting myself be immersed into this kind of schedule as much as possible i don't want to pressure myself too much so i just want to remind myself that that it's okay to still be adjusting also guys before i end today's vlog i just want to let you guys know that i may not be able to be as active on my other social media accounts like instagram i won't be as active anymore since i will be focusing more on youtube and tiktok unfortunately now um social media isn't really much of a priority anymore compared to when i was in high school compared to when we were younger i'm pretty sure you guys can relate so our priorities have shifted um, and also instagram can really take a lot of our time my time personally so i'm limiting my use of instagram that's one of the changes that you guys should be expecting for me i hope that's fine with you but i'm still out there okay i'm still on instagram facebook tiktok x slash twitter i'm still there but maybe more on youtube and tiktok so yeah that's all for today um see you guys tomorrow Sounds of flowers breaking ground, but I can never seem to get one going. Track it is go green. Actually, three fourteen, but three fifteen and eleven. I just finished my meeting, and I replied to some emails, and just finished all the stuff that I have to do for work. It's also a good day. It's not raining, so that's also one thing. And uh, what else? Uh, today, guys, same schedule. My classes will start at five thirty, and then. It at 8.30. It's starting to get really traffic. Basta around 4 to 7 p.m. here in Cebu. Starting to check the traffic, guys. So I'm sorry about that. So it's best if I leave from the house um, at 3.30 p.m. That's the safest. Start low. Was I in your arms or was I stone sober? Won't you dance with me or light me the way I can't see? I'm on my way home now. I decided to end the day for vlogging the car because 
I realized I haven't done that in the past few days. It's 8.20. We finished a bit early today. I already had my dinner. Um, the banh mi sandwich that my mom got for me before going to school. And what I'll be doing is I'm gonna start editing the vlog. It's my plan, by the way. Um, on Thursdays and Saturdays, since my schedule is not super hectic during those days, that will be my editing time for my vlogs. But I think I forgot to update you that my mom left already. If you guys didn't know, I live alone. I basically have to consider my meals on my budget. Meals, grocery, but for the first month, I got my parents ko ang aking groceries. Since I'm living alone, I get to be the master of my own budget. So I need to wisely spend everything. Otherwise, I'm gonna go broke. Basically, my limit is just my allowance that my parents give me per month. My own money, my earnings from social media, for example. I get to save them, which in that area, I'm lucky. That's basically the overview of my budgeting or like how I save. I'm still trying to master it. Um, definitely soon if I get a grasp of everything na I would be happy to share it with you guys but for now yun lang. <laughs> that's how I do it hi everyone so I'm still preparing right now today is day 5 it's a Friday well it's not so TGIF this Friday because we have classes tomorrow and it's our first exam in law school yes First week, we have exams already just to, you know, kind of assess our learnings from the first week. Um, actually, I'm thinking of not including that na lang since I think I have enough clips for this vlog. We have more exams to come pa naman and I will vlog those exams instead um, so that tomorrow I can focus on studying for my exam. So I hope you guys understand. So right now, I'm preparing. I will go to school early today. Um, time check, it's 1.12 p.m. and my classes start at 5.30. It's also a hot day today, contrary to the first three days in school. Medyo gloomy and rainy. And I'm also feeling a bit better now. Yay! I'm also feeling a bit better. So, um, I love how this vlog went. In a week, you've seen me get sick and you've also seen me get better from colds. Hopefully, when I get to school, I find a parking spot right away because there's another stress to deal with. My driving skills have been tested a lot of times in downtown campus. Yeah, I learned how to parallel park my school. an hour to drive back home it was a bit traffic because it's a friday plus there's an event in talamban campus today i pass by tc every day which happens to be one of the most traffic areas here in cebu um i had my dinner my mom marinates my food for me enough for the week so as much as possible she comes here every week to we prepare, she stores it in the fridge and you know, I cook it day by day. Although I say my gratitude to her every single day, I just wanna make a quick shout out to my mom for all the support, especially that uh, she prepares my stuff for me. And I'm also adjusting a bit since the load is way different now compared to when I was in Paul Sai. Guys, you know what's funny? A lot of people are actually curious as to how I still balance my life, 
how I'm still able to maintain a healthy relationship with, you know, my boyfriend. Um, what we would do is, you know, we try to update each other as much as we can at the end of the day. So we would call every night after school and he's actually so sweet, you guys, because, you know, he sent me this reel that kind of like have this guideline of what to ask your partner after having a rough day he wanted to apply it to us and it really makes my heart so happy because he's so willing to adjust for me he's really excited naman to know what happened in my day and sometimes di ko talaga kaya guys na mag talk especially now that you know, I still have you guys, like I have to update you and you know, I have stuff to do personally, study, those kinds of things. Because, you know, it can get super tiring and most of the times I'm overwhelmed and what he does is just to extend his patience and understanding. I mean, he's also busy, um, he has work and it's just, you know, my first time having that kind of person in my life. Aside from my mom, parents, of course. But and it's still one week pa naman in law so we'll see um the behavior that you know my partner is giving me right now is so telling as to what kind of person that he is the lesson is that um guys don't settle for less and you know for those who are also in law school or for those who have partners that are in law what i would say is that understanding is um i think the very core value of you know in the relationship for it to work but um empathy is also a, is also a thing to consider i decided to end this vlog today because i really have to focus on studying for tomorrow's exam um i have my milk here I, um actually i wanted to grab a cup of coffee for tonight but i figured it would be bad for me because i also need to sleep and now i just got myself a glass of milk and hopefully this will help me clear my mind thank you so much for watching until this part of the vlog i really really appreciate it so if you guys are not subscribed yet in my channel please subscribe and with that being said see you guys in my next vlog